So a friend of mine tried to rope me into a discussion today, uh, and I'm just going to make a video on this because it's important for everybody to understand my reasoning and logic. I see way too many web apps that use integers as the primary key for objects. And you can see the integer in the web API endpoint URL. And the thing about that is that because it's an integer, it's pretty easy to guess. If you've got an integer of, say, 100,000, you can basically replace that with 999 and get a different object fairly consistently because what's happening here is you've got a sequential value that's incrementing itself on every addition. The problem with this is that it also opens up a lot of security issues. And so I would personally consider the use of integers for primary keys to be harmful. This is based on my experience at large companies, and this is based on my experience actually writing code. The fact is, UUIDs, or in this case is on my screen, UI, UUID version 4, is the best option. Now, it's important to understand that a universal unique ID has multiple versions of that standard. Uh, they use namespaces or they version differently based on timestamps. And so one of the things you have to understand is that a UUID is not a specific standard type. It is simply a standard representation of data. And so as a result of that, the UUID that's on my screen here might represent a UUID version 4. And we know that based on the values. But the fact is, you can't always assume that's the case. You can't always assume that a UUID is a UUID version 4. It might be a version 1. It might be a version 2. It might be a version 3. You don't know. And so unless your system is generating a specific version and you've standardized on that, be careful. Be very, very careful. However, using a unique identifier that is generated using these systems, in this case, a UUID version 4, is actually the safest from a security perspective. If I have a resource that's got a primary key of, for example, the UUID version 4 that's on my screen, that's pretty hard to guess. And if I assign that to a user and say, just say, for example, I've built out a system that says this is my user ID and this UUID represents who I am in the system, that's pretty hard to guess. If I was user 1 because I'm an admin, well, an attacker could just go check the system, see that it's a integer key, and at that point, reverse engineer the system and find the admin account pretty easily. And so as a result, I don't consider systems that use integers to be secure. And whenever I encounter them, I do what I can to either mitigate that risk or flat out redesign them to use UUIDs. And I've done this multiple times at very large companies because it helped them maintain standards of compliance and security to protect their customers. And so if you're still building systems with integer primary keys for objects, you're doing it wrong and you're writing crappy code that is insecure by design because of your ignorance.